and welcome. It's Jillie Cube and I'm here on the Sunshine Coast in Queensland, Australia. Originally from Birmingham in the United Kingdom. I've had a few people ask me recently. You haven't got a full Australian accent. That sounds like a bit of brummy in there. So I think it is actually well and truly over 35 years uh, since I've lived in England. And obviously my accent is not going to go now at my age. Uh, um, not that I want it to. But that's, I've been living in Australia a lot longer than I ever lived in the United Kingdom. So um, yeah, that's a bit strange. But anyway... On with the art. I am going to, um, without further ado, I am doing, do doing a, um, I'm going to do a kind of a rainbow swipe. I've got all these lovely colours here and I'm just going to see how I go doing the big stripes and um, then see how I go swiping them. And I think I might swipe them with something a little bit different this time. I'll see. So that is the uh, cool red and this is the ultraviolet purple. So I haven't done kind of one of these um, swipes for quite a long time. So why not now? I've just got this little bit of fuchsia pink. I might put that at the the bottom end of this extravaganza of colours. Oh, just a little fun thing I thought I would do, do, do. So might need to use some of the colours that I've got more of and more of more than just one line. So we will see. We will see. Let's See what I've got here and this one is a green I can't remember what green it was because it's been mixed about two weeks not sure um, I will go I've got this kind of oh, I think I might swipe in that I think that was my very delicious it's very dark almost looks black so I might now, if I put this yellow up here, it might send it all green, but I uh, might swipe from the other end if that's the case. We'll see. We will see. A bit down here because I've got plenty of it. And um, I've got a little bit more of that blue, so I might put that up here. And I will put some white in between, I suppose. Why not? Well, this is a um, certainly a bright one. Where's his trousers? There you go. Wow, look at that. So I am going to tilt it off a fair bit. So just nice and gently, just take your time. I know lots of people watch my pause and they think, oh, I'll see you and think what a mess has she got going there. And, um, but stick with me, <laughs> see if I can get myself out of these messes. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't, but you have fun trying. Absolutely worth it in the end, most times. So there you go, it's all kind of poured over the edges. Still kept a bit of its shape, just just double your fingers on the corners. There's no uh, rules that you can't finger paint in this. In fact, there's no rules whatsoever. That is what's brilliant about it. No rules. Okay, I have got this very delicious. So I might pour it on here. See how I go, Lo Benson. Are you come to have a look what Mummy's doing? You've had your dinner, so don't tell me, Phipps. Okie doke, I'm gonna, Benson, you better get out of the way. I've got to use my heat one. Mind your melon, mind your melon. Just, just going over it with my heat one to get rid of any air bubbles. 
Got a little bit of a gubber there, but that will get swiped off. Now, what I was thinking of was trying my great big, um, it's my window wiper that you use to wipe down windows with the blade, but the actual soft rubbery thing wasn't quite soft enough. So I've added the, uh, a piece of soft plastic file divider. I only want this very tip to do my swipe. So ladies and gentlemen, let me see. Actually, I'm gonna heat, I'm gonna heat the actual bit of, just slightly, not so it burns, but just so it's more pliable, just heating. That bit of plastic. Feel it. Yeah, that's it. That's cool. I don't know if it'll make any difference whatsoever. So it's just, just maybe letting it tip into it about a centimetre. Just took a bit of paint off. Oh my goodness. Keep going. I've got to keep going now. I can't stop. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right, I've got to do the other side now. <laughs> Once you commit to it, just keep going. So here you go, just dropping it in about a centimetre. Wowzers, trousers. <laughs> I know this is a bit, as your father up here, but I'll tilt it back towards this way to cover that black up because I'm not particularly loving well, it's not black actually, it's very delicious, but I made it very dark, so it almost looks black. Well, there you go. That's the big super swipe. So, what, well, these are from the cheapy shop, like so cheap, oh my goodness. Just look at what is happening. There is no silicone and no Floetrol in this particular batch, that is. Oof. Okay. Oh my goodness, that is beautiful. Go over with my wonder wand. Oh wow. See if I can get something coming up through that black. Then I might not have to get rid of so much of it. But that is gorgeous. Wow, wow, wow. at that that's gorgeous I'm not liking that too much but I'm so worried that if I tilt it it'll take out the shape of my cells but let's try it very slowly not that you have to keep them all but i just would like to i don't want to lose those just very very slow i might just leave it to see what pops up there and then i bring you back to it but that is gorgeous absolutely gorgeous so happy with that I were gonna leave this to dry off a bit because I can see all the cells are popping up here. So they might all come through and not really show much of the black. So we'll give it a bit of time and I will be back. But that is gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. I'm chuffed to bits. Okay, I'm back. It's only been about 20 minutes and I am not going to tilt over the black because I kind of think it gives it like, I don't know, like an ethereal, eth or whatever, a starry night or, I mean, look at this. Wow, I, I mean, <laughs> if I tilt, it would stretch the cells out and that might give it a whole different look and look absolutely wonderful, but I am so, I'm so thrilled with this. It is just gorgeous. It's absolutely like, I don't know, it looks good enough to eat, good enough to eat. I've sort of done some swirls on the very edge because I'm thinking when it's dry, I might embellish it with something. 
see the blue cells came through there and the yellow is underneath that black but look at it it's almost like yeah like a starry night and these effects in the paint now i'll have to keep well having a video is a good video record to have there of how you layered the colors and what's worked so i love the layering of them colors i think it's worked out perfect so i hope you like it too um yeah coming on this crazy art journey with me and please give it a go if you never even believed you had any artistic streak in you it is there in all of us just waiting for you to give it a go so until tomorrow my cellmates please join me again tomorrow and see what <laughs> i've been getting up to in the art room so until tomorrow take care and bye for now